What if I told you the mulch you've been faithfully spreading around your plants might be doing more harm than good? It's true. For years, gardeners everywhere have been told that wood chips are the holy grail of soil protection. They look neat, hold moisture, and seem natural. But beneath that tidy surface, something entirely different is happening. Your soil is quietly being starved. Instead of feeding your plants, wood chips are robbing them of nutrients and slowing down the process that creates truly fertile soil. The good news is there's a simple natural mulch that turns lifeless dirt into rich, dark humus up to five times faster. And the best part? You can make it yourself for almost nothing. Let's get straight to the root of the problem. Wood chips might look like a gardener's dream, but they're actually nutrient traps in disguise. They're made mostly of carbon and contain almost no nitrogen, the very element plants and microbes need to grow. When soil microbes start decomposing wood chips, they pull nitrogen out of the soil to balance the excess carbon. The result? Your plants get left behind, yellowing and struggling to grow while the microbes hoard all the nitrogen just to break down that wood. And it doesn't stop there. Wood chips take years to decompose. Over time, they can form a dense, crusty mat on the surface that blocks air and water from reaching your soil. This suffocates beneficial organisms, reduces oxygen, and halts microbial activity, turning your once-living soil into a slow, compacted system. You end up watering more, fertilizing more, and getting less in return. If your goal is to build humus and vibrant, living soil quickly, wood chips are like taking the scenic route on a broken bicycle. There's a faster, more natural way, and it starts with using what nature already designed to feed itself. Nature never mulches with dead wood. Walk through a forest and you'll see it. Layers of soft, decomposing leaves, grass and plant matter slowly transforming into rich, black soil. That's the real secret. A green compost mulch. This isn't compost you pile up and leave for months. It's a living blend of fresh greens and dry browns that starts feeding your soil the moment it touches it. Green materials like grass clippings, vegetable scraps, and green leaves provide nitrogen. Brown materials like straw, dry leaves, or shredded paper bring carbon. When you mix them, you get the perfect balance microbes crave, fuel for life in your soil. This blend works fast because it mimics nature's own process. Microbes dive in breaking down the mix into humic acids and stable organic compounds. Within weeks, that mix becomes humus, the dark, spongy, nutrient-rich material that defines truly fertile soil. Creating this mulch couldn't be simpler. All you need are two parts green material to one part brown material. Mix them together until you get a soft, crumbly texture. Not too wet, not too dry. The greens provide the nitrogen, the browns balance it with carbon, and together they create the ideal microbial buffet. Once ready, you can use it directly as mulch. Spread it about two to three inches thick across your garden beds, keeping it slightly away from plant stems to prevent rot. Always finish by lightly watering the mulch layer. Moisture activates the microbes and starts the biological magic. Within a couple of weeks, you'll see the difference. Darker soil, stronger roots, and better water retention. But if you really want to supercharge this process and turn your soil into a microbial powerhouse, there's one more trick you need to know. The fermented liquid mulch formula. This method is where the transformation goes into overdrive. Think of it as, well, a probiotic drink 
for your soil, alive, active, and brimming with beneficial microbes. Here's exactly how to make it. Start with 10 kilograms of your green compost mulch and place it into a 20-litre bucket. Add 15 litres of clean water, enough to submerge most of the material, but still leave some airspace at the top. Cover the bucket loosely, you don't want it airtight, and let it ferment for seven days. Stir it once every day to add oxygen and encourage healthy microbial growth. After seven days, strain out the liquid. What you have now is a concentrated microbial elixir. To use it safely and effectively, dilute one litre of fermented mulch liquid with five litres of clean water. That's the perfect balance to bring your soil to life without overwhelming it. You can pour this mixture around plant roots, use it to water your beds, or even spray it over dry mulch layers. It speeds up decomposition, boosts microbial activity, and floods your soil with natural nutrients, all while helping organic matter transform into humus in record time. Once your mulch is in place, consistency is key. Keep the layer between two and three inches thick and maintain steady moisture levels, not soaked, just damp. You can reapply thin layers every few weeks to keep feeding the soil. As it breaks down, it not only adds organic matter, but also improves structure and water-holding capacity. In just a few weeks, your soil will start to change colour, from pale brown to rich, dark chocolate. That's humus forming before your eyes. You'll also notice your soil stays moist longer and feels softer underfoot. That's because humus acts like a sponge, absorbing water and locking in nutrients right where roots need them. This approach doesn't just work faster than wood chips, it works smarter. Instead of waiting years for dense wood to rot, you're giving microbes an instantly digestible feast that fuels continuous fertility. Here's why this process outperforms traditional wood mulching by miles. Microbes don't need decades to digest soft plant matter. They get to work right away. The balanced carbon to nitrogen ratio in green compost mulch allows them to multiply rapidly. That microbial explosion generates heat, humic acids and stable organic compounds, the very building blocks of humus. In practical terms, that means your soil becomes more alive. It breathes better, holds moisture like a sponge and continuously releases nutrients at a steady pace. You'll water less, your plants will grow stronger and the need for chemical fertilizers will drop drastically. This is regenerative gardening at its best, fast, efficient and completely natural. Beyond speed, the beauty of green compost mulch lies in its sustainability. You're using what you already have, grass clippings, kitchen scraps, fallen leaves, and turning them into gold for your soil. You're closing the loop, feeding your garden with its own waste, and reducing what would otherwise end up in landfills. Every batch you make is an act of regeneration. You're restoring the soil's natural cycle, increasing biodiversity, and helping the planet breathe a little easier. It's gardening that gives back, both to your plants and to the earth itself. Wood chips might look clean and tidy, but they're not the quick path to healthy soil. They're slow, nutrient-draining and suffocating to the life beneath the surface. A green compost mulch, on the other hand, is alive. It builds humus up to five times faster, brings soil back to life, and transforms even the most tired patch of ground into a thriving, fertile ecosystem.
So the next time you reach for that bag of wood chips, stop and think about what your soil really needs. Life, not lumber. Start using green compost mulch and the fermented liquid formula and watch your soil transform from dry and lifeless to dark, rich and teeming with energy. If you found this guide helpful, make sure to subscribe to Timeless Crops Haven, share it with your gardening friends and help others discover the natural, sustainable way to grow healthier, stronger crops. The Timeless Way.